Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Ty back here with another video and I'm going to be talking about something you guys need to do right now in NBA 2K22 my team. 23 my team, I apologize man. It's still new, it's still fresh, but give me a break. Now here's the deal. Before you do this, okay, I'm gonna ask you guys to pull up my video ranking the uh, ranking the the, the the trophy players. So I dropped a video ranking every trophy case reward on a tier list. Now, why is it important that you pull this up? Well, you got to know what trophy case you want to complete first. Do you want Kyle Korver first? Do you want Derrick Rose first? Do you want Richard Jefferson first? Who do you specifically want first? Now, for this, you got to, in my opinion, know who you want as your specific Galaxy Opal. Now, why does that matter? Well, I want Anthony Davis as my Galaxy Opal. So I got to figure out, okay, well, who is in the Lakers? Because you got to figure out what division you want. So who is in the Lakers division and who would make for a good player in the Lakers specific division. So let's check it out. The Lakers, James Worthy, he's okay, but not great. The Clippers, Elton Brand, absolutely horrible. The Warriors, okay, who do the Warriors have? Jordan Poole, not ideal. The Kings, I mean, who do the Kings got? Peja, not who I'm looking for. And then you got the Phoenix Suns. Now, I want Anthony Davis are any of these my top priority of, of getting no i mean i don't really love any of those specific players so you know you kind of gotta figure it out yourself before i mean before you really diving into uh to anything more specific some other options that you could go with i really like richard jefferson and uh it looks like he is the brooklyn nets i believe the brooklyn nets player so you could go for richard jefferson but then you gotta figure out, okay, if I go for Richard Jefferson as far as the pink diamond, then who is the lock in in that Atlantic division? So these are things you gotta know, and it's kind of complicated. But the re the basic reasoning is you need to make sure to buy these in the next two days, okay? You got to use your tokens on these specific things, okay? There's four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like there's nine specific things that you can specifically claim. And it looks like it's a choice. So you're gonna be able to choose who, what team you specifically do end up going for. Now, again, I'm still trying to figure all of this out. Again, it's new to me. So for me, you know, looking at these things, well, I've got to specifically figure this thing out. Now, the Atlantic division, you get Patrick Ewing. Am I super high on him? No. Jimmy Butler, I'm decently high on. That might be end up where I'm going. Uh, Clyde Drexler, I could, you know, maybe go for like a Dikembe or Arvita Sabonis and then Clyde. AD again, there's not anybody there. I really love CP, obviously not loving that either. So maybe the meta is going for Derrick Rose first and then Jimmy Butler. I think that's what a lot of people are going to do. And that's probably what I'm going to do as well. So with this, obviously, you just claim this. It's simple. You claim the historic pennant. It's kind of RNG. This stuff is RNG, but this basically guarantees you your historic pennant, and then you can exchange it for whoever you specifically want. So even if you don't know who you want uh, right now, that's okay. Go through, claim these with each and every one of your tokens, because, I mean, at the end of the day, these are important. They are one token per thing, and these, I mean, it's it's gonna be helpful down the road, right? I mean, these are these are team photos, they're rare moment. And honestly, I don't know for sure if you can save these, but maybe it's a good idea to save these as well. So, I mean, again, I'd go through and purchase each and every one of these. That's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna see what you specifically can do with them. Because I, I think if you can save them, that might be the best option and just wait to see exactly what you do end up pulling uh, before locking in anything. But I mean, I know Unbeatable Jacob, massive shout out to Unbeatable Jacob for even bringing this video to my attention or this in the token ex exchange to my attention. But just getting all of these puts yourself in a way, way better position. And again, it's nine or 10 tokens for all of this. I mean, you, you can't ask for much more. It's a 2K day type of event. And it's not gonna come very often. So yes, take advantage of them. Get everything I just got. So I just went through, claimed every single one of them. So you basically one token for one current team photo exchange card. Head to the exchange to redeem a current team photo card of your choice. Now, 
Here's where I would say, okay, I'm, I would I would advise you guys to hold on to these because, for example, and, and I'm just, you know, throwing this out there, I don't know entirely for sure what I want to do with these yet. So, basically, you could lock these in and then you get a choice pack, an option pack on whatever you want. Now, again, I would recommend holding on to them just, in, in, just for now and until you're exactly 100% for sure what pink diamond you want to go for. Just because, I mean, I think there's other ways to, you know, to, other, other ways to earn this type of stuff. For example, I'm not sure exactly, but I mean, you get, let's say, a moments trophy case award in this. You get a centered piece trophy. Again, I don't know if I've got those uh, or if those are, you know, the exchange. They look like banners. It looks like franchise moments, historic jerseys. I mean, and again, centerpiece option pack. So yes, those are going to be some of those things. And so I personally would wait because let's say, for example, I'm just throwing this out there. I think these are random teams. So let's say I go ahead and lock in for the Bulls and then I get 6,000 points in my team unlimited and I do end up getting the Chicago Bulls centerpiece. I, it's going to be useless. I'm going to have nothing to do with it. And so for me, I'm obviously redeeming these. And then I'm just gonna hold tight for now, right? Because they're not going anywhere, right? The, the, those, those, you know, miscellaneous collections or those things that I got for the exchange, they're not going anywhere. I'm always going to have them. I don't think there's a time constraint on using them. They're gonna stay there. But make sure within the next three days, you log on into the token market and you do what I just did. I, mean, I can't stress that enough. It is so, so important to go through, redeem each and every one of those tokens. Because look, they're one token each. You get nine different pennants or nine different basically trophies to be used for your trophy case in the future. Make sure to do that, guys, because in the long run, it's going to save you and help you guys out massively. Tokens have been kind of a crapshoot so far in a way. Obviously, you know, you got to use a lot of them to obviously get the, a, a trophy for a specific team. But if you can do this in the next couple of days, trust me, trophy grinding is going to get a ton easier for each and every one of you guys. That's going to wrap it up for my video today, guys. Hopefully it helps you out. Again, guys, just trust me, get these, and then stay basically stay tuned until, you know, you have a shot to get somebody. So rumor has it, you know, they're going to be available very soon. I still don't necessarily know for sure because let's say for specifically, I, I'm you know the Dallas Mavericks I don't know where each and every one of these things can come from obviously you can redeem some of them with you know the the exchange but not all of them and that's kind of why I'm telling you guys just to hold tight for now and just see what comes out of it long story short if you have the opportunity for the 2k community or the 2k day to redeem those things for one token make sure to do so it's gonna wrap it up for my video today guys hopefully each and every of you guys did enjoy it drop a like on the video subscribe if you are new and as always man I love you guys and have a blessed day